Hey there guys, I'm Danks564 and this continuation file let's play of uh, Star Drive 2 as check affiliation and we're doing pretty good, frankly. We're kicking this uh, Aptaris Hive butts and uh, all the the bears are not an issue, but we found quite a few guys here. Uh, for example, Drylox and uh, Polop, I think. Yes, is it Polop? Uh, but that's not we find. We will be able to uh, deal with them, I think. Okay, this guy, you know what, I'll just send him back to the refueling station while this battleship... Um, well, I'm thinking actually this fleet should uh, probably join this guy here, because from here they... come on. From here they will move towards... Uh, I'm thinking this planet, and it's mu he, he has much better chance reaching this planet from here, I'm thinking. Mm. Even though that's that's our space derp, uh, there's no difference. It would be better just to leave these guys here at the, at the planet, and uh, we'll just... Uh, Go from here. This way, this way it will be more protected. Okay, this battleship is moving towards this fleet, and they will eventually move here, disable those guys that uh, crystals that are attacking us. They will require some uh, refueling, I'm thinking, along the way. Any gas giants here? Uh, don't think so. We need to check uh, this planet as well. What? And why are we not sending them anything? I don't know. Well, fine, if they die, they die. <laughs> Who cares? Oh. Okay. They sent some c couple of troop transport just to die. I'm totally okay with that. Uh, and come on. We need to... Really? This transport fleet to just... Just... Uh, they need to make this uh, interface a little much better. Come on, all I want is just to... Yes, here. No, you... Here. God. Okay, move. Really? Where is my transport fleet? Okay, there they are. Let's land these guys here. Yeah, we lost quite a few troops there because, well, I automated them. It shouldn't have been like this, but it happened. And we'll send this guy. Thinking first he'll check this system, and then he'll uh, go and check the main system. Um, where was that worker? Yes, you. You move here. I think there was somebody here, but they might already be dead. How, how's production going? It's... well, it's going. Pollution of sequence were where? Uh, okay, that's pretty good. Really nice production on one. Uh, after it will finish... yeah, that's pretty long construction queue. So I'm okay with that. Is it... yes, it's a fleet. Well, let's move closer here, just in case they will try to intercept. Uh, okay. Destruction of uh, another... Um, transport fleet, that's fine. There's an asteroid field, okay. And will you be able to move here? I'm thinking so. You guys can destroy this little fleet. They have... The f reinforcements are heading towards them, but I don't think they will reach it. Uh, okay. Plus five happiness everywhere. That's great. Uh, what do you want to research next? Payload density. Yeah. Hmm. 
So these weapons will split into multiple warheads upon one of the condi condition. Parent missile becomes jammed. The parent missile is intercepted by point defense. And parent missile deployed up to multiple mm, reach up multiple deployment range of its sub warheads. Well, that's interesting, but yeah. Do we want antimatter reactors, or maybe antimatter cans are better? This weapon is magnetically sealed packet of antimatter, magnetic sealed spirits, and allows the antimatter to react. With a large amount of energy damaging the target, this weapon is equally effective against shields and hulls. This weapon requires both ordnance and power to fire. Uh, I wonder if it's long range or if it's short range. Uh, maybe we should just create antimatter torpedoes. And because uh, we have decent guns, well, we have decent torpedoes, uh, missiles as well. So. You know what, let's go for antimatter torpedoes. We have guns, we... I would like to see torpedoes more. Uh, I don't resolve it, I think. There's absolutely no way that it can do anything interesting here. And we get ultra rich and heavy gravity world. And quite a lot of ships here, actually. Will we have enough time to disable these guys? I'm thinking yes. So you'd go do that while you might as well go check this planet because I'm thinking he's coming from there. And uh, yeah, that will be useful. Uh, you guys might as well start moving towards somewhere here. You can. You okay, construction on one. And bank on Chul has been completed. Can you produce anything useful? Um, no, I don't think so. Okay, how much money we can produce here? Like, if, if as much as possible. Yeah, it's still producing money. You know what? Do that. Maybe like a couple more on science. Yeah, I like that. How's our research project going? It's actually doing pretty well. Eventually we might uh, just uh, not resolve it. That's fine. Huh, conveniently he actually made towards us. And you guys might as well engage these guys. Uh, what do they have? Mostly corvettes. I think this is a cruiser. And like four frigates. Yeah, they're doomed. Let's actually uh, fight in person. And did we research AC? I think so. Because I was planning to research it. Okay. Uh, what cruiser? Arctic cruiser, assault cruiser, and assault cruiser. Uh, well, assault cruisers might as well go forward because. Uh, that would be more appropriate, I think. Uh, do I even need Corvettes? Well, they will stay somewhere behind, I'm thinking. Uh, no, I can't drag them. Okay, uh, never mind. So let's just start. Uh, kill this guy. Corvettes, you just move here. I don't need you on the front lines. You guys might as well, uh, I don't know, shoot somebody. And uh, these guys. Well, they're attacking, so might as well continue attacking. They need better engines. If I knew that there were no engines, well, if I checked, if I knew, I could have checked. Uh, if I've checked uh, that they there are no like additional engines in the research, I would just pick an engines because there are plenty of. Uh... Yeah, this the salt frigates are not that good. Uh, they need better armor, better shielding. So, tier 2 shielding would be better than uh, fighter shields. But what should we gonna do? So, well, it worked, most importantly. I'm thinking the 
long range ships are much more effective. Okay. And this couple of ships actually got some uh, promotions, Artibal ships, 10 assists or kills in a single combat, and marksmanship bonus. That's uh, all really useful. They uh, so I either need like better engines so they would get closer faster and uh, actually start doing damage faster, or I need uh, like a much better. Uh, let's engage this crystal. So how many of them there are? Uh, only six. We have a battleship here and the cruiser, so I'm, sh I'm pretty sure I'm good. And some corvettes even. Let's fight it. Let's find out. Long range weapons just do too much damage. I'm thinking. They're too effective. Uh, let's begin. Why don't we? And let's just engage. Okay, you guys don't stop. You guys don't stop. I'm thinking we'll be good. We have missiles. So we should be good. They die like from a couple of shots, so even if we are not going to be able to kill them right away, eventually we will. Uh, our corv corvettes are pretty bad against them, but we'll do fine. It's not like I need corvettes to kill all of these guys. Yeah, they do like almost no damage to my shields even. Done. Ah, <laughs> one Corvette even survived. Okay, good. I'm happy with that. Pretty sure we'll be able to take on the um, actual site of the of these ships where they spawn from. So you know, let's go here. Um, uh, let's let's renew it, I guess. Trade treaty with the dialogues. Uh, hmm. Okay. For some reason they're not that happy with me. When did I refuse to trade with you? I didn't. Yeah, let's go with that. And... Uh, what kind of... Mm, I don't think we can use any... I have, like new shields and new engines. If you have them, apparently you don't. So, never mind. Goodbye. And our spies killed a spy. Okay. Uh, I don't think it will be enough to reach here. So. Creating a refueling station would be uh, would be good, but let's uh, let's just travel, and we'll see how long we'll get. Uh, okay. What were we doing here? Oh, right. We were actually trying to engage this fleet. Yes, I'm thinking so. So this ship is blo oh, new university, on one. Yeah, sure. Let's uh, create fleet. And you guys can kill this guy, or not, apparently. And we'll need more troops, because these guys... Oh, you know what, actually? They've, they're rebuilding, right? There's uh, stuff here. Mm, 
well, uh, like that, and uh, you'll probably get a uh, no, deployable shield. You will. Why don't you grab a fusion carbine and uh, deployable shield and uh, wound repair package? Hopefully, this will be enough. Let's send them. Do you have. Yeah, you have some troops. So, launch them as well. Let's combine them. And then we'll send them here. Oh, it's a, it's a colony ship. How, uh, how cute. Um, yeah, they have one here. Let's check this system as well. Anti-manager repeaters. Let's let's see what this torpedoes at least look like. Uh, plasma torpedo, ghost gun. Oh, anti-manager torpedo. Okay. How much space does it take? Well, it stay, takes as much as ghost gun, but it it does huge amount amounts of damage, and uh, uh, but it wa fires once per twenty seconds. So, well, that's not that bad, frankly. But the travel time is... I wonder what kind of travel time is it has. Because even though this one shots uh, shoots once per second, 10 seconds, it will, it will not be shot down by anything, right? But this is more than 50% more damage than uh, the Gauss gun. Uh, the mass driver, I mean. Well, it's pretty good. We'll maybe use it for something, I don't know. We'll see. But not right now, because we already have a pretty large fleet. So... Um... Okay, this ordnance fabricator, I don't think we need that much ordnance, frankly. Um, what do we want to research next? You know what, let's study the Minishal Rift as much as we can. Right now we should be able to finish it within, I don't know, 10 turns or something like that. So I'm pretty sure we're good. And you guys can go on the planet. Well, you'll get there, I don't know, I believe in you. Uh, heavy weapons? Rocket launcher for our troops would be nice, frankly. I would like that. Mech factory. Armored ground units. That would be even better. Uh, defend immobile defensive unit. Nah, let's go for tanks. I want some tanks. Oh, and they they're launching colony ships somewhere. Good for them. <laughs> More ships for us, I guess. Or is this ship... This ship is going here, right? Where is it going from? I don't know. But we'll eventually find out. Is it, do they have something here or something? I don't know. You go back. I don't know. Hmm... What, what do they want? Trade rights. Small to medium. You know what? Let's. Uh, why don't we go medium for medium? Firm deal. Sure. We're now making lots and lots of money. Uh, we can reduce our taxes back to their zero. Nah. Well, let's move it to five percent. Yeah, that that should be good. And approval ratings are through the roof. 90 on Chular 4. The belt is 100%. This one is 70%. Yeah. We're doing quite okay, I would, I would say. Uh, Tor, by the way, why don't you do something? Uh, I don't know. Build a Xeno mine? Uh, let's, let's check Tor. What do they do? Uh, yeah, sure, why not?
so these guys can't actually reach this this place so you know what we'll build a refueling station here we can afford spending one more ship and you go to the refueling station 810 that's more like it mm. clean energy would be nice but nah they will not go for it uh, so no you know what I'll just capture a couple more of your worlds and then we'll see what the hell is this this bastard's destroying my my ships okay I see You guys return to this planet and, uh, you know, take care of him. We'll need... Oh, he's returning back. Okay. Mm -hmm. Polluted atmosphere, okay. Minus half food per farmer. Did produce a lot of food? No, it's, so, well, who cares? Okay. They don't have anything here. But there's a... Well, there's a wormhole here, so we might explore it. And now you go here. How's our special project going? Almost there. Uh, did we talk to these guys? I don't think so. Oh, they're out of fuel, so why don't they go and refuel? Okay. Oh, and these guys, they went f totally in clicked. <laughs> Little bastard. What is it doing in dirty business? Where's my ships? Go and kill this guy. Our scientists have finally completed their research into the dimensional rifts that have been uh, appearing throughout the galaxy. Since the discovery of Star Drive, we have been manipulating what we can call substance to pro propel our ships faster than light. But the gap between what we have been doing with substance and what is occurring within these rifts is substantial, and we think it, we finally understand it. Put simply, we discovered subspace purely by accident we had focused so much energy into a single point of space that we tore a hole in it we learned that we could expand the hole that that we could expand the hole that we could create a pocket of subspace and put a ship into it and this discovery obviously changed our way of life it gave the stars to us this risk that we have discovered it is essentially the same phenomenon but on a massive scale it is a tear in our space uh, in space-time but it's being created from within subspace to put it simply an intelligent species resides in subspace and possesses the capability of opening tears like this thus, like this at will the power and knowledge of these people these masters we must be like ch children to them as a result of this research, we can now traverse that, uh, through a dimensional rift. So we can now travel through these rifts. I wonder what's on the other side. Well, hopefully not some demons, you know, that will devour all and then will have ask us to worship them or something. Okay, uh, what do I want to build here? I don't actually want to build a lot here. Really? Uh, actually, labs or something like that would be nice. Supercomputer research lab would be nice. Supercomputer would be nice. Especially now that since we have lots of money. So, yeah, go for it. Have fun. Are we producing everywhere? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, expect, except on Chul, but Chul doesn't have any production, so. That doesn't matter. Can you guys go here? We'll eventually reach, reach this little station. Son of a... Where, where is he coming from? D 
do they have some planes somewhere in here that I'm not aware of? They probably have a, sp a planet somewhere in here. It's just that I can't see it. Derp, they have the planet right over here. How, how did that happen? When? Why? What? How? And they have six people there. Uh, I know. Let's out of fight. I don't think we can uh, do anything much with uh, that. They want shields. What kind of technology do they have? Nothing I'm interested in. Uh, okay, we need to build more ships. Freighters. Uh, where's my... you? Oh, uh, why... Why not you, okay? Build us freighters. Now uh, that's pretty much out of resolve. Yeah, we didn't take much damage, but we've taken some. You know what? Go to explore. Maybe they, maybe they're coming from through the warp hole. Where's my? Ah, uh, they probably destroyed it. And did the... yeah? They're all long. <sighs> so good this game. Okay, move, move away. Cool. Max units. Attack. Heavy fighter bay. Do I want more fighters? Well, we have fighter shields. Might as well try power armor. Ooh, shiny. Space marines. Go, space marines. Uh, yeah. Power armor. <laughs> Simply because. <laughs> that sounds cool. Okay, now I think we can actually drop our troops on uh, this planet. Come on, really, guys. Do it. Let's fight because I don't want to lose huge amounts of troops. Because for some reason we're doing it when. Uh... Ah! So, this one has absolutely no hit points. Okay. And, uh, do we have a medic here? Yeah, yes we do. Good. How many of them we have? Although we have two, but, uh, you know what? Let's move these guys here. And turn. Yep, these guys are moving forward. Let's heal you. And, uh, why don't we kill you as well. Good enough. So let's make a couple of steps forward. Okay. Let's allow them to come a bit closer towards this. Uh, you can fire him, right? Not too close. You can fire on him, right? No? Yep. This block... <sighs> really? Can you shoot him? Oh, well, now you can. Oh, you have a combat knife. You have a combat knife as well. I don't think you'll be able to reach anybody, so just stay put. You though. So what's what's the range? Six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. One more, and it should be enough, I guess. And uh, why don't you move here? And. Uh, I think this guy, so I'll move them instead. Yeah, the fusion uh, 
fusion carabines they're not that effective if uh, enemy has like at least some armor this guy has yeah. okay even like if they have some armor it's absolutely ineffective okay no really again knives what's up with the knives guys Okay, now you charge. And you shoot. Will you be able to shoot from here? From here, definitely. Yep. And can you shoot? Or from here. Okay, good. Not that good, frankly. Uh, and charge this guy. Well, you might as well move here somewhere. We'll close in eventually. Okay, attack. You too. Uh, you can shoot twice, and that will probably kill it. Yay, go us, only one lost. <laughs> so. Not that bad. Okay, neurotoxin bombs. Mm, not something I'm hugely excited about, but I guess they'll work. What? Go this, kill this guy. They're indeed popping out uh, units from this uh, from this planet. That's right under our noses. Okay, begin. Attack. And move. It shouldn't be too hard. Like, how, how hard could it be? Really? Five carrots versus one? Yeah, that's already pretty much dead. Okay. Well, at least now we're blockading that planet, so I uh, don't think they will actually be able to do anything. Anything bad. Um. Okay. Then I guess that's good. You guys blockade. All oh, right. Well, you're blockading how this. Did this guy appear there? I don't know. Well, we'll have to send eventually this guy, I'm thinking. Uh, but I think we'll do that in the next episode. I will rearm them and prepare them, and then we'll send somebody. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed it, and goodbye.